Good evening, I'm Dana Tyler. We begin tonight with the dreaded summer track work at Penn Station. It is set to begin Monday, and it will reduce capacity by 20% in and out of the nation's busiest rail hub. Today, the MTA detailed options for Long Island Railroad commuters who are waiting for an end to this commuting nightmare. CBS 2's Carolyn Gussoff live at the Mineola train station to give us a preview. Carolyn. Dana, the MTA's mantra for the next eight weeks is it's only temporary. Together we can make it through the summer. But commuters we spoke to today say they have no idea yet how they'll make it through. I'm just going to try to wing it the way I normally do and hope for the best. Banker Mike Lazier attempting his normal routine Monday, but LIRR officials are urging their creatures of habit to make changes. Consider trying to do things a little differently. If you have the option of traveling closer to the start or the end of a peak period, that will help steer clear of crowds. Steer first to LIRRSummerschedule.com. Check daily for all train times and alternative options. Then sign up for MTA alerts for real-time changes. If you stick with the rails, every peak LIRR train will have two additional cars. Riders diverted to Atlantic Terminal and Hunters Point Avenue can jump on the subway or a ferry from Hunters Point. Ferries will also be traveling between Glen Cove and 34th Street or Wall Street. Preps are underway to ready this never used terminal, but there's only room for 375 passengers on two ferries. Others will be turned away. They have an alert system electronically that the minute that the ferries are full, they'll be able to advise all of the, you know, would be passengers to divert to buses or trains. 200 coach buses will fan out from eight park and ride locations for an HOV lane trip to Midtown. Take the train. If you take the train now, you should take the train next week as well. But already we're hearing from holdouts who will squeeze onto the roads. I'm renting zip cars. I'm doing whatever I can to avoid the railroad. Others giving up on the physical commute altogether. I think working from home would probably be the best thing. This rider focusing on the temporary part. You got to go through stuff in life that you don't want to do and the Amtrak thing needs to be done. The MTA says it will be monitoring Amtrak's work and holding them to that September 1st deadline lest this become the endless summer of hell. In Mineola, Long Island, Carolyn Gussoff, CBS 2 News. Carolyn, thank you.